Hi guys, welcome to Opportunities Worldwide. Today there is an exciting opportunity for any young person around the world. And it will involve training in entrepreneurship, impactful research or policy, and the best three young people will be able to get awards of up to 30,000 US dollars. So I'll be sharing the link to the official website where I am on in the description of this video. That's all in the awesome pressing problems. This is an eight week online fellowship for young people to start an impact to research policy or entrepreneurial project. It's financially supported by Open Philanthropy. It's a $500 scholarship and it's the test from July 8th, August 30th, 2024. Zero fees for you to participate. It's fully online. It's for young people ages 14 to 20 worldwide and $30,000 in fact, as I had already said. So 8.5 out of 10 of participants are likely to recommend the fellowship to a friend interested in impact. The non-trivial fellowship is definitely the most useful thing I have ever done all my life. This is from one of the alumni. Choose your cause, get expert guidance, find a solution and make it happen. So this is a world-class community since it's calling young people from around the world. You will learn advanced concepts from advanced philosophy, economics, mathematics, and more. This fellowship has been an amazing opportunity, not only to learn more about the most pressing issues, but, so, but also to work on a project which could have a real impact in the world. This is another alumnus talking about the, the training. Previous fellows projects have helped them secure impactful internships and funding. Note, these opportunities are earned and not guaranteed. My research during the fellowship gave me a better overview of the biosecurity landscape, which helped me get accepted as one of the few non-university students at the Stanford Existential Risk Initiatives Biosecurity Seminar. This is also another alumnus. Then another benefit of attending this fellowship is that you learn advanced concepts from advanced from academic philosophy, economics, mathematics, and more. This fellowship has been an amazing opportunity not only to learn more about some of the most pressing issues, but, so, but also to work on a project which would have a real impact in the world. This is by Grace, who is an alumnus from the UK. And these are some of the places where the alumni go on to attend, like University of Cambridge, University of Oxford, the London School of Economics and Political Science, Harvard University, Stanford University, so this is one of the alumnus at age 17 who was able to co-author a UN report. So Jason started the fellowship with a commitment to making a big difference, but without a clear path. His research helped him notice the lack of global governance of artificial intelligence. So his project proposed an international AI agency. After getting expert feedback and revising his approach, he flew to Geneva to meet key stakeholders and co-authored a report for the United Nations. So this is a real international experience that will expose you to a number of international organizations and people. So if you know any, any young people in your community between 16 to 20, please share this video with them. Don't let them miss this club opportunity. I wish I had such opportunities when I was that age. So another benefit of this program is that you'll be able to solve real global issues, tackle some of humanity's defining challenges, select from our focus areas, or choose your own to champion. So these are some of the major focus areas like artificial intelligence, policy reform, biosecurity, existing risks, global priorities research, promoting effective altruism, and other areas. So for artificial intelligence, Nearly 50% of artificial intelligence researchers put the odds of catastrophic harm from advanced AI at greater than one in 10. So AI could help solve humanity's greatest challenges from healthcare to climate change. However, without proper safeguards and oversight, advanced AI could also pose a large risk to our survival. To maximize the benefits of AI while avoiding potential downsides, we must develop AI safely and responsibly. 
our shared picture depends on it. Let's look at another focus area, which is policy reform. Institutional incentives frequently misalign with humanity's long-term interests. Our challenges know no borders. Most policy stays constrained within them. Technology outpaces policy governance. Struggles with myopia. Technology outpaces policy governance. Struggles with myopia. While progress accelerates, policy plays catch up. But if we can spread concern for the global rather than priority good, improve incentives to act in our long term interests and facilitate cooperation with issues, we can rise to our collective challenges. So, my next issue that they focus on is on advancements in synthetic biology could help bad actors develop a virus that is as infectious as COVID 19 and as lethal as move force. So the next issue is existential risk. Expert forecast has predicted that 8% chance of a global catastrophe this century. Okay, let's look at other areas. Many of the world's most pressing problems are not What problems are missing from this list? This is not just a hypothetical question. Fellows receive expert guidance to explore and work on whichever problems they think are most pressing, with the exception of projects we think are likely to be harmful. Indeed, many of the prize winning fellows work with projects not on this list, like Diana, Grace, and Law's projects, engineering genetically modified mushrooms to serve as a resilient food source during low life disasters. So they $30,000 in funding for the most impactful projects. The first prize is $15,000. Second prize is $5,000. And the third prize is $100. Our projects are evaluated on the basis of the most progress. Our projects work into solving an important problem over the course of the fellowship. Our most promise, what potential do the projects have for solving a crucial global issue? And the best pre pre presented, which presentations present the most compelling idea and robust evidence. So in the curriculum, you'll get the tools to bring your vision to life. In this one, you'll explore your values, answer big picture questions about what matters most to you. Use those answers to figure out what kind of problem means the most to you. And in week two, you'll choose a pressing problem to address. Uh, you investigate specific problems quantitatively, figure out which ones are most worth tackling, and in week three, you make a career plan. You resolve uncertainties about your long-term plans, get clarity into your strengths and weaknesses, and overcome what's holding you back. Week four, you research and develop your ideas. Now you can generate ideas that are solving a problem you deploy, you deeply care about, and is a good fit for you. In week five to seven, you have the weeks Sprint to see how far you can get to validate your idea, develop a proof of concept, conduct a literature review, or produce a plan to address the biggest risks and uncertainties. And in week eight, there'll be a sprint and demo day. Use the final sprint week to put the finishing touches on. At the end of the week, you'll present your project to the rest of the fellowship and demo day. So let's look at the curricula. Okay. What you'll do as a participant in this program, you'll choose a pressing problem in the world, then you connect your project to your long-term goals, and then you'll find and test an effective solution. Week one, you'll explore your values. Okay, I will. Okay, I'll just summarize. In week one, you explore your values. Week two, you choose a pressing problem to solve. Uh, in week three, you make a career plan. Week four, you, you research and develop your ideas. In week five, you make a plan to test your ideas. And so much more. So let's go back to the previous video.
So the application process takes less than an hour. You will first do an online application, then after submitting that application, there will be a video interview for the program leaders to get to know you better. The deadline is 31st March. So who is eligible for the fellowship? Uh, you should be 14 to 20, you haven't started university and you are located anywhere in the world. Uh, what is the $30,000 in funding? Prizes are awarded based on new projects have made the most progress, show the most promise for impact, and were best presented in their demo day presentation. These prizes will be awarded in addition to the scholarship all fellows receive. There are three prizes on offer. The first prize is $15,000 grant award, second place $5,000 grant award, third place $1,000. Who is funding the fellowship? Okay, there are so many donations. The organization has received around this fellowship. Do I have to pay to apply? No. There are no costs to apply for this fellowship. And what are they looking for? They're looking for world changing ambitions, critical thinking, and curiosity among people who apply. What can I spend the $5,000 scholarship on? Award winners will receive $500 scholarship at the end of successfully completing the fellowship. The scholarship is not contingent when attending university, and the scholarship is awarded in addition to any prizes won. Recipients must use the scholarship for the purposes of educational and personal development. This means, for example, purchasing textbooks, courses, technology, tuition, tutoring, or supplementing and paid internships. So, Let's look at the application process. Okay, there are three main things. Uh, first, you enter your email, then you look at the application form. And then the last part is a puzzle or quiz. Guys, I'll end here. But if you know any young people between 14 to 20 and they have a university, please. Don't hesitate to share this video with them. So if you like this video, don't forget to leave a like so that YouTube can share this with more young people like you. And also don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss a certain Goodbye.